everybody. Welcome back to the Kel and Rich Show. My name is Kel, and this is my wonderful husband, Rich. Thanks, Kel. It's great that you guys are here with us. Thanks for stopping by. We're going to continue getting ready for our Queen's Right concert. We're in concert mode. We're standing up. We have our, in this case, Dream Theater shirts on. I'm sure we're going to have Queen's Right shirts on. By Friday. Yeah. And we're going to go in one album back now. Okay, we've done two from uh, Verdict which is 2019. Mm-hmm. This one's actually 2015, and this is from the new era. This is the, the, the Todd era um, of Queensryche, and um, he okay. actually, on the, on the last record, the verdict, he actually plays drums as well, as oh, does cool. those amazing vocals. Nice. Um, this is going back to Condition Human, and this is the title track, so let's go okay. right to it. Okay, ready. And sound effect. Hear your fortune from Zoltar. Hard work pays off over time, but laziness, it pays off right now. Heed my advice, young one. Relax and enjoy yourself today. You deserve it. Oh, you're not going to be able That's to okay. see it. Oh, there you go. There you go. There's a little bit, there's, there's baby Zoltar. Love baby Zoltar. I got Baby Zoltar is a little gift for, for Kel. All right, let's share the screen. We did okay. that. And Thanks <laughs> for being here. messed up. Zoltar's freaked me out a little bit. All right. <laughs> Lazy. Laziness. Pays off right now. Condition human. Yeah. 
their bridges. The choruses are just, just, just great. influence there. that back oh, and oh finished with it nice wow i love that song <sighs> cal i love it let's get the rating system out okay we're leaving our headphones on because we're still trying to assess the sound yeah of our new your, setup. yeah keep your keep your face close and we're all good so feel free to answer your for yourself what yeah, you think just take a little pa- little pad or whatever it's out of 15 it's kind of fun so we, what we do is we do zero quarter half three quarters one okay you can give two if you want, I guess. You could give bonus marks. You can marks. break your scale. Sure. Okay, this is the gold unicorn prog rock scoring system. 
prog metal in this case. Prog metal Actually, this was this was very very proggy. So right, yeah. prog. But it had right. riffage, and I mean, it was it was it's prog. Okay, listenable. Oh, I'm a one. Me too. Did you find there was a musical and instrumental vocal and instrumental balance? Yeah. Every Queen's Rex song, I think, does. Yes. Creative use of sound. Oh my oh, God! Definitely. Yeah. I would give that one bonus. I totally was going to do that. Right. Okay, bonus by here. how many? Stay here. I'm trying, I'm trying. I just don't want to hit the microphone with the clipboard. Okay, so Mark, I'm giving it 1.5. Oh, we're going to break the scale? I'm tra- I'm breaking okay. it, so you do what you want. Yeah, I, I re- th- yeah I'm, I'm a, I'm a 1.5 as well. Unique and different sounding? I that definitely, song definitely, yeah. yep. It's a one? Yeah. Do you hear it as distinctive and standing alone on Definitely. its own? Definitely. Absolutely. That's a one. Harmonic? Absolutely. Melodic, yes. Melodic? Yep. Was it harmonic? Was it melodic? Uh, were there distinct musical characteristics that you liked that are specific to the genre? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Prog, definitely. And then prog metal. Um, yes, I'm a very strong one. Did you get lost in the music? Absolutely. 100%. And that's not always the case. Yes. What we're finding. Yes, this is true. Mm-hmm. Did it hit you in the feels? And if so, which feels? Can you give them some choices in case they haven't no, seen this? No, they're your thing? feelings, not oh. mine. Oh, um, nostalgic uh, oh. because there was elements of my favorite prog bands uh, from the 70s and 80s, including Queensryche. Um, so I give that um, a 1.25. I'm breaking the scale. 1.25. Yeah, I'm giving an extra quarter. You do whatever you want. It's your rating scale. What'd you do? You gave it a one? I gave it a one. Uh, does the... I keep dropping the <laughs> fucking mouse. <laughs> uh, does the band exhibit and possess musical diversity? I'm definitely a one. Say more about that. So sometimes I've found that I have heard in the comments that some bands, all their songs sound kind of the same. There's a recipe. And so you know it's such and such when you hear one, two, and three, and that their songs are kind of repetitive in nature. And so I'm not familiar with, I don't hear that yet. Um, I'm still trying to identify the songs when I hear them, but you um, you might feel that way. It, it sounds like Queensryche, so I'm going to say it's a half a point. I mean, it, but it's such a good song. It's one of my favorite Queensryche songs. And not so scoring far. a whole point is not a demotion. It's just we're trying so to... So I'm giving bonuses. It kind of balances classif- off the other. We're just trying to classify <laughs> why we all hear sound and why we like what we like. Uh, did you want the music to stop? That would be negative one. If you wanted it to keep going, that's a plus that one. That song was a perfect length. I, yes, I wanted it to go. So let's just give it one because it's, it's not negative. It just would have been even better if it went more. But did I'm not going to mu- get greedy. Right. Did the music take you yes, away? Yes, that's a one. Did you hear a wall of sound? Uh, no. No, that's not a, that's a 0.75. It was a lot of beautiful, the arrangement was great, it was full, the production was great. It didn't take me away, but it doesn't always have to. Uh, I'm a 0.5 because um, I, heard, I heard a little bit of a wall of sound when the choir came in. Yeah. Um, does, it speak, does this song speak to your soul, and if so, in what way? Yeah, yeah, it, that's a full point. Um, it reaffirms my love of what I what I love about Queensryche, you know? Yeah. Because it's like, when was the last great Queensryche song that at least, and again, there may have been ones that have been done, uh, especially later in the Jeff Tate era. I just don't, I'm not familiar with those albums. I just, you know, the, the Silent Lucidity, The Empire, you know, Lady Wore Black, all those songs, it reaffirmed my love of, of the Queensryche sound. And it and it amps it up. This song, this song is my favorite of the three that, that we, we've that, done tonight. Yeah, that we've done tonight. Mm-hmm. So we've done Dark Reverie and we did Light Years. Yes. So. Okay, so you count yours. Oh God! So just bear with us, guys. So you count up your your totals or whatever. I gave it a fifteen out of fifteen. Okay, I'm gonna have to hold this to do it. Okay. Two, three and a half, four and a half, five and a half, six and a half, seven and a half, eight and a half, nine and a half, ten and a half, ten. Uh, Quick seven mathematics. Five. 11 to 5, 12 to 2, 2 5, 3 to 2, 5, 14. 15. I'm a 15 out of 15. 15 out of 15. Yeah, that song is killer, and I really hope that they do that. On um, Friday. Yeah, it's the title track um, of Conditioned Human, right? Is that what I said? You did. Okay. So, yeah, 
it's uh, I, and I believe it's the last song of the album, which is really interesting to have it's the title to have the title track as the last song. I need to hear it more. I want to hear that song more of, all, of the three songs that we heard. I think um, the two light years and dark reverie. I can hear and it can be on a playlist. That song goes on a playlist. There's no doubt about it. Yeah. And and I'm really happy with what I'm hearing from the from the uh, the new Queensrÿche uh, two albums that we've heard so far. So. Love to know your thoughts. Thanks, guys, of New Messiah for the intro and the outro, which you're going to see. Absolutely. And uh, thanks, all of you, for being here. Love to see your comments. Yeah, and thank you to uh, Andy Baumgartner. Hi, Andy. Mr. B for concert mode. Yes, he coined it. He Well, we, we coined it, but he said standing mode. He said, he said, what's with the standing mode? And it triggered us to say, to say, well, it's kind of being at a concert. Yeah. And both of us at the same time went, yeah. concert, concert mode. mode. It's like, here we are, like right here with you guys. Yeah. You know, we got the lights. Love live music. We got the, we got the instruments. And um, we got the girl. <laughs> there you go. Do we kiss yet? No, but wait. Hi, Snoop. I love our little... Our little, little Snoop sent me a present. Accoutrements. All right, it later, works. guys. It works, Snoop. <laughs> kiss, kiss, kiss. We'll see y'all so, later. It's like, it's like Bart with a cupcake. Z- out, z- out, z- out. Bart Simpson. Later. Mm-hmm. Bye.